child? Yes. Eh? Yes. Prophet. Eh? Yes, I am. You are very much disappointed. Why are you disappointed like that? You, were, you went to the prophet in Nigeria? Yes. Huh? Um, um, I, I was blessed in Nigeria. But when I came back, the attack came through my daughter. You went there. Now things are tough when you come back. Yes. It's becoming serious. Mm. Mm. Come on. Out, you demon. What are you doing to her? Yeah. Huh? She, huh? She's destroying. She's what? She's a destroyer. She's destroying in the hospitals. She works in the hospitals. She's delivering people that I don't want her. She's destroying her. what? I'm trying to make her sick. I'm giving her a headache. And now I'm yeah. using her daughter. You know what? She, you know her worries. She, she went to the prophet, to the senior prophet. She was excited after she's blessed. After you are touched by the man of God, Satan won't leave you. When she come back now, this left and right, problems, sickness, pains, everywhere. She's like losing money. Also, she's losing money. She began to say, ah, how I went there. Now, what happened? No, it must happen. For a testimony, it must happen. So, what are you doing to her? Uh, yeah? She's destroying my kingdom. She's destroying Wherever kingdom. she goes, she speaks about Jesus. So she's you got the spirit of boldness, and I want to take it away. I've given her a constant headache. She constant must, headache. She must become mad. I send her daughter to bash her head so that she can become mad. She is too much. She is too much enough. Listen to this. Why you attack her more when she come back? Why? Because the anointing was too much. She's you, got you too much that? grace. You hear that? She's got too much so grace. she came back with serious anointing. Now Satan also will come seriously, not knowing that God can still do it. So today you are leaving her. In Jesus' name. I knew she mustn't come huh? here. I knew she mustn't come. I made her to be weak. I knew. You don't want her to come here. I didn't want her to come uh, here. Why you don't want her to come here? Because God has anointed her for the times like this. I no, didn't want I, her to I, come I cut here. your head. You, mu you must come out and never enter here in Jesus' name. And she'll be surprised. <laughs> She's still manifesting even now. Rise up. Look at her. Look at her. It's your mom. Rise up. Mama, can you lift mama? She can see me now. What is happening to you? Uh, Prophet, I went to Nigeria and I came back and I think it was a week after. I just had dreams. It was like there is a war against me and they had injured my head. And last, last Saturday it happened physically. You saw, like a dream, they, they injured your head. Yes, they injured. They wanted me to be mad. They wanted you to I be didn't mad. even know my house, where it is, or I couldn't drive. I was like a vagabond. I was in the street, in the dream. In the dream? Yes. Now, from there, you start to have headaches. From yeah. there, I have headache. And even now, I said to my daughter, maybe when we live here, I should go to the neuro doctor because it's like it's in the brain. <laughs> You can't solve, you can solve uh, the spiritual things with the medical. Mm -hmm. How do you feel now? Uh, uh, How do you pick. feel now? Now I feel like something has just been lifted up. The headache is gone. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus.
Thank you, Jesus. I think that's what I'm talking about. That. Thank you, Jesus. Where did you go to Nigeria? I was there from the second to the ninth of May. And then when you come back, it becomes like this. I think I have to warn people like that. That don't after you go to see a prophet. From there, don't expect that everything can just be solved like that. Don't just expect something like that. You come back with anointing, that anointing still have to fight things around you. Even anointing can call enemies. Do you know that anointing can call enemies? Which she said, wizard, they come there, they fight you. Handling that anointing in a right way, you can be able to overcome. It is possible that you can have anointing, but you fail to handle it. Because now, like her, she was beginning to fail to handle it because she was worried. But if she might have stopped worrying and began to say, I'm coming from there, I know I'm anointed, I know I've got this anointing, and speak, remember, you speak your tongue. You can bring Satan to yourself. Please, whoever is going to see Prophet T.B. Joshua, know that you are blessed. But when you come back, when you see challenges, don't say nothing has happened. You are also insulting us. Most of you are, you, are, you, are, you are insulting God. God bless you. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Father, for my deliverance. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. You are free. Thank you. Amen.